money and money for new economic competition on the topic the human race consciousness. Occasion race is one of the five major races in the world. Occasion, occasion race is also known as Caucasian or Indian people race. So, every kind of races in the world, all we know about races is that there are different types of races like the black race or the white race, but then there are actual categories for that black race and those white race. And Caucasian race is actually one of the uh, races of the white race, and it is one of the five major races in the world. And it is also known as Caucasian race or the European race because Caucasian is actually found uh, in the uh, the word Caucasian. The term Caucasian origin is in the Caucasian first mountain, and it is famous in uh, that's why it is also called the European race. So it was introduced in the 1780s by Caucasian School of History. In the United States, the root term Caucasian is still in use as a synonym for white. So in the 1780s, there was a famous school of history known as Caucasian School of History, and this school usually worked as a school where uh, racial categories were categorized and people were categorized under different races. And the Caucasian race was actually introduced by the experts at the Caucasian School of History. And it is actually said that in the United States, the term Caucasian is actually used as a synonym for white, which is actually Actually, a very uh, they say most of the people say the term cookies I should not be used for the synonym of white because both the cookies are just a racial category and white is a noun or a term used for people who are usually fairer in skin color and it's actually said that it's actually a part of racism for calling cookies like people white because white people and the cookies like people are totally different people. So the Caucasians are classified by hair skin, straight or baby hair, and lighter eye color. So if you have noticed the Caucasian people, they usually have fair skin, lighter eye color, uh, hair color, and baby hair or straight hair. So the, uh, you might have seen Americans and foreigners, and they usually have lighter eye color, like light gray eyes or light blue eyes, and they're usually blonde and uh, not exactly blonde, but they have like wavy dark brown hair and all. The Caucasian race is dominant in North America and European countries. So one of the reasons why Caucasian race is known as European race is because it's dominant in Europe and uh, in North America too. Because North American people are usually defined by fair skin, wavy hair, and light eyes. Each of the modern Caucasians' populations were not exclusively white, a range in population from white skin to dark skin. So, so one of the reasons why the term white should not be a synonym for cookie site is because cookie site people are not usually dark brown, uh, dark, I mean, not usually white, but they differ from skin tones. Uh, so most of the skin tones differ from white to like dark brown. That's why it should not be used for a synonym for the term white. The cookie sites differ from place to place and according to the surroundings. So if you look here, there are three types of white cookie sites women and there are three types of cookie uh, sites men too. The alpine, uh, the alpine cookie sites are usually, they usually have dark brown hair color and their skin tone is usually healthier and darker compared to the other two. And the Mediterranean and Nordic ones are, the Nordic ones are usually found to the upper region so they have and lighter skin color and blonde hair color. The meridian are like a mix of the alpine and the nordic ones. Over the centuries, there had been a lot of problems regarding the racial category. One of the major conflicts was the Caucasian War. The Caucasian War happened because the Russians weren't happy with the people of Caucasus and they had attacked them. And not only that, but there had been a racial category, a racial like wars against uh, different races, but the cookie sites are superiors or the necroids are under them. So due to the cookie sites, uh, there had been a lot of problems around the world and one of the problems is that some of the cookie sites, some of the white people, their thinking is that since they have uh, white skin color, they have like healthier skin tones and since 
they feel beautiful. Uh, they think that the other races are under them and due to that not only the other races but then also the other cookie sites are suffering because of that. And the cookie site culture is actually not a specific one because like Iran and United States, if you can uh, if compare the two countries' culture, they're totally different. So we couldn't get a straight uh, straight uh, straight point on the cultures because there had been a diverse culture. As the sites have been diverse to North America and the European countries, and there had and one of the languages of the European countries is Armenia, and most of the cookie sites use that language. Now we have come to the end of our presentation and I hope you all know what's meant by the human race